interested in looking at. So I can do all this in one day. Well, yeah, like two guys can do all this in one day. Yeah, that's why we can. Once we get in here and build, it will be our final. Yeah, so you're saying all of this could be done in one day? Yeah, this is just like. So, so at what point do you want to have? come in and finish all of this after which task? What has to be complete for you to do this all in one day? Mm -hmm. All this is framing, basically. So you need to be, I would, all, you need to, he needs to be right in here. He needs all this to be done in all these units before you do yeah, it. Yeah, so it's probably starting from right here. Yeah, yeah. that's what I'm saying. I'm coming in, ideally, after the third floor is framed, so I can run my lights up all the way to the roof and don't have to weld them at every floor. After the third floor is framed, yeah. and we're working on the but, second floor. Yeah. But, uh, so check with, check with Rick. I need to see with Rick because I'd like line set from the first floor all the way to the roof. So, Rick will work with you. You, you. you tell him what you'd like yeah. to do. And like when we get... No, I say, when I start running my line sets, I want to start on the first floor, run them all the way to the roof. So, you'll be finished, start the same third floor. Now, before you get done, mm -hmm. you know, even with the second, you're going to go up and just kind of chisel. Right, we're going to yeah. stair step it. Okay. And just like that, you enjoy it. So then when you put your line sets in, um, you saw waste, and that's the end. So you, you really don't have anything else. I really don't have anything until we get up okay. up to the top. Then I can start coming back and start running those so bulges on the first floor, get all that done on the second floor. And Right. Running lines, so yeah. to start all and I understand time. that it's like you've got a day, you've got a day and a half, two days in the low voltage, maybe. Yeah. Maybe. And maybe. your line sets, you start them in there, and they're just a continuous deep block. Yeah, it's just from the bottom, bottom, all bottom up, top, second, and then up to the second. All right, Ed. Now here's where I need help. Well, what it was is is. Understanding that critical path, complete second floor frame. And I, for some reason, I see you, I remember you moving backwards on it. This way. Okay, I know I need to do this here, there's no constraints. Okay, and put the arrow. I need to frame the second floor walls. This delivery has to happen first. When are you going to ask for my help? I don't know. <laughs> I'm just doing all the easy stuff first. Okay? Otherwise, is it like between floors? If you if you had a riser for us, we could be one inch and go by floor to give us a place to transition and terminate the drawing. Um, when the drawings come out, okay, yeah, that way check that out. Yeah, you may or may not have to do that. I just said that because they they on the last one they, they in one area we had several. I don't mind putting me in a uh, pull box somewhere, you know, and just make 
before you usually move over yeah. when you have a right? Yeah, well, as you say, we can walk it with you and Jeff um, once we get the food growing and we'll see if we can eliminate some of your cargo. Uh, I'll have Felipe come out here so he'll be the one pulling it. Really you see what I did, Raphael? Okay. I don't know when he's back to how the stuff's coming. But I'll I want it on the first one. Okay. Well, I moved it back. Okay? I moved it back. Because when you build it, you should build the guest room. You should build that um, back of house stuff at the same time. Okay. Otherwise, what we end up doing is we end up building guest rooms, and then we stop. Everybody gets started back of house. We end up coming back and doing all the decking. Uh, we got to try to get it moving even more. Okay, that's what the ground is. Okay. 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 Layout and install voices, right? Okay, so what I've done is here create a critical path through the framing. All I did is said here and framing walls. I run it to the end, he's completed the framing of the walls. I put out here the layout of the joists and install. Okay. They relate to rooms, joists. 205, 206, 205, 206, joists, installed. 203 and 204, layout and installed. He's going to give me another. Uh, next note, I'll put it here so you can <coughs> your voice. That creates a second critical path that you have to get done. Alright? Okay. That goes there. And then, still on framing. Okay. Back of house wall panels, north end. Okay, you can start those after 211 and 212. Right? Mm -hmm. Okay, there's no dates. You come here, you've got your second unit. He's allowed you three days for this unit here. These dates can change. We have to get production. He's allowed you one day in here on the end. That's your critical path there for the trusses. Okay, to be able to complete that second floor. Then you have your metal decking. Mm -hmm. That joists you do your ledger layout, your decking, um, the handrails at the balcony, and the walkways. Here and here. That's after the back of house buildings have been installed. Okay. So that comes down to here. These guys here, uh, the electrical, they're all in these guest rooms. These joists are driving the last one. You're going to shift here a little bit just because without right. the joist, you won't be done. As long as we recognize that, he's going to shift a little bit. So you're not 100% done. Um, Coney can't get in there. Okay? okay? So then these, well, they all go to the end. Of it. These, these can shift down in here. Okay? But basically, they, they come in. Your wiring, 
I'll make them some more tags for the rest of those right now. Okay. I mean, they're, they're just, they are what they are. Yeah. You know. Okay. Danny, I thought yours would be the most complicated one on the board, but I guess not. Huh? Okay. All right. Is there anything that I'm missing up here, guys? If, you're, if I can make a suggestion. Absolutely. You, 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 you talked about working backwards. This is called a pull plan, and we work backwards, but we don't work backwards initially. And the reason we don't work backwards initially is because most of us are used to working from here to here, from start to finish. So we don't confuse you with working backward full planning language, right? However, when we get to this point, we, we want you to come up here and say, okay, and look at one, for, for instance, this is for you, Danny. <coughs> is this the only thing with respect to what all these others do too, but is this the, when this is complete, can I declare that I have met the conditions of satisfaction? Or is there something else that needs to happen in here? You know what I, you know what I could do? I could say rough wall. Okay? You know it's framing. I can add a little building place here up here. Six rooms, frame, including lockdown, joist complete, including back of the house buildings, um, interesting middle hallways, including low walls. If you complete his work, get that work, that work is completed. Right, right. Which I'm not Rather than drywall. Yet. Correct. You're just as complete as you can be in that room. Right. Yeah. Okay, so, so that's the exercise we go through. Okay, if we, we ask that last question. Is this the only thing from your perspective that constrains you from saying I'm complete? Yeah. And we want you to get used to using that word constraint. Okay? We want, we want that common language among all of us. Okay? So, again, we don't want you sitting back. We want you to get up here after we've done this and, and take a hard look. Now, with respect to interrelated tasks, make sure that you can do this at the same time or that this does not constrain you. Four, you guys worked in concert before, and if that's true, great, okay? Um, we've got a lot of interconnectivity over there. We don't have much interconnectivity here. So what I'd like you to do now is to get up here and take a look at what we've got and ask yourselves for each task you've got, is there anything besides this that constrains me or keeps me from doing this? Is there anything that constrains me or keeps me from doing this? So, work backwards. Does that make sense? Okay. Good, good. Well, what constrains me is that, I mean, if this right up here doesn't get done, I can't do none of my stuff, you know? Right. Like if, uh, like if, uh, if these walls right here, install wall panels. Yeah, I mean, if I don't have these wall panels installed, in 209 and 210, then I can't lay out, you know. Uh, so the highway on all I can't lay out this stuff. Hang on to that question just a minute. Let me answer this question, all right? So this is for you? Yeah. Right? He's got it here that. So 209, 210, wait a minute. Yeah, no, yeah, yeah, this box. Down, yeah, I got it. I just I got it. I don't know. He's got it. Well, we, we'll, we'll, yeah. You know what I mean. So, so could we create one task? Yeah, we could. Box and layout. Yeah, we could. We okay. Could get, and yeah, that's we could create. We were talking about we were going to go. Yeah. Okay. okay. Box and layout. So box and layout. Yeah. We'll make all of those. So in this case. Yep. Right. And in this case. Right here. Right? And in this case, right there. Right? And in this case, 205, 206, so this is the same thing. Box and layout. Yeah. This is layout, right? 201, so the, the constraint is here. The constraints are not this way. Right. They're this way. Right. Right? Mm -hmm. Okay? Right. And when I look, had to look at it, 
it was over here, but you can have additional. Right. This doesn't actually, this box of layout 209 to 10 does not really constrain 207. No. Uh -oh. This just implies this is the way you're going to work based upon yes. that happening. Mm -hmm. Right? Yep. So we don't want to put too many hard constraints in here. This is this is a hard constraint. You cannot start that until this is done. All right. You cannot start this until that is done. Right? You can do this, but only if that's done first. Okay. So that's why I say we, let's make sure that the constraint arrows are between the right tasks and they're often between different trades as opposed to one trade constraining itself. So yeah, the same exactly. thing would be true here. Right. Would it or not? <laughs> you know, I, I wouldn't do that. You wouldn't connect. You no. Would just leave each one on their own. Right. He has to have the freedom to work. Right? And the freedom to work is he's constrained by this for this. He's constrained by this for this. He's not constrained by this for this. All right. Just like what happened out there, we have a hole. He went and worked around that hole. Yeah, all these need to be box and layout. Yeah. Right. We're right. Just, we're missing some here. We're missing twelve and ten. Ready. Okay, so we need a, yeah. another twelve and ten. Anyway, okay, so but from here from here, say if I'm on nine, right? This twelve and ten, this goes down here. Okay. This is still down here below. Okay. This is the wire that goes from here, he comes down. So you're, you're, you're going to install the rough end wire after you've done the box right. layout. Yep. Is that, does, but is that a hard constraint or not? Yeah, I mean it is because if, if I don't have my boxing in, you know, then it I... It won't tell you what you measure. Yeah, exactly. So that's a hard constraint. Yeah, exactly. Between myself, yeah. Right. Yeah, stand that's alone. just the way they got to go, yeah. That's They're all standalone constraints. So then, um, well then, like right here, Rick, I mean, I'm not, I'm not constraining, is this, would this mean that I'm holding him up? No. no they're, they're this now, you see, that could be a way to play. This goes here, but you see, that that's the old way we had it. Now each one of these here, you see. Yeah, exactly, yeah. That.